my name is Kath Shackleton. I'm producer here at Fettle Animation. And I'm Rose Lane, illustrator and director here at Fettle. Thank you so very, very much yeah, for you. shortlisting Survivors of the Holocaust for your Children's Book Award. It means such a lot to us. Thank you so very, very, very much. The Survivors of the Holocaust started out as an animated children's uh, TV series uh, many years ago now, uh, for, made for BBC Learning. I do remember the day the Nazis came to power. You started to hear noises that you hadn't heard before. It was really scary sometimes. We heard the news. We knew something was going to happen. One and a half million innocent children were killed during the Holocaust. I only know that I survived. I never forget what I went through. The world should never see that again. My name is Lillian Black and I chair the Holocaust Survivors Friendship Association, a charity of Holocaust survivors and refugees who survived Nazi persecution and came to Britain to make a new life. I hope you're going to support this award uh, and I am a definite convert to this form of artwork in our mission to deliver Holocaust education. Six of our uh, survivors uh, have been delighted to work with Fettel Animation uh, in the production of the animations and obviously the book. So these are six stories of children who did survive, came to Britain and made a new life. I'm Trudy Silman and I'm aged 91, but I was born in Czechoslovakia and I became one of the first members of the Holocaust Survivors Friendship Association. Well, uh, I'm really delighted that it is now available in book form, and I hope that you will be able to see it, handle it, and read it, and, well, enjoy is perhaps not the right word, but to learn from it, and that, in fact, we've all got to be friends and behave decently amongst each other. So it's been a great honour to work with uh, these Holocaust survivors and our work continues to win awards around the world, which has been a great, incredible privilege. So I did the interviews with the Holocaust survivors and continue to, to, to work with them and getting the messages out there. But Zane here did uh, many hours of, of work coming up with a design for them. Do you want to talk a little bit about some of that? Yeah, sure. I uh, chose my own style, mixed in with, uh, you know, political propaganda and political cartoons from the 1940s, you know, from countries of Germany, France, uh, Poland, USA and, and England. Uh, and there, because I thought it was kind of a, a, an easy step into showing something like the Holocaust, which when we worked for the BBC, we couldn't show uh, the true horrors as such. So doing it in a kind of abstract way, it's sort of like for the age group who were pitching it at the, the younger audience, means that we could show a kind of a, a cartoon uh, violence as such. Uh, without showing the, the true horrors, which could be uh, very disturbing for uh, a younger audience. Hello, I'm Ryan Jones. I was animator on the original Children of the Holocaust series, and I was the layout designer for the Survivors of the Holocaust graphic novel. So my job was to take all the assets, the characters and the backgrounds, everything that we had from the series, and make it work as a still, flat image, um, making sure that the stories still read well, still worked well, we still got the messages across. Um, so we worked closely with the publishers to make sure that all that worked and uh, we got a nice product at the end of it. Thank you so very, very, very much again. Really appreciate it. Do take care and uh, keep safe. Thank you very much. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. Bye. Bye.